Hello everybody and welcome back to There we have it. Hey roll. Yeah, so a quick update on the rubber duck Mac, rubber duck truck Mac, rubber duck track Mac. Yeah. Update on the Mac. This will just be a quick because it doesn't happen so much, but uh, some smaller fun things have happened, so yeah, I thought we're gonna check it out, so I have a video to show you. So yeah, let's uh, find out how it looks right now. Come on over here. Bam, bam, bam! Here we have in all its glory with the trailer on. Looking pretty sweet, I think. What do you think? Leave a comment. So first of all, I thought I'm gonna show you all the text and the number plate here, how I did that. As you can see here, we have the number plate. So I use some decals paper or yeah, it's easier if I show you like this. So I bought this paper on Amazon and had no idea how good it or bad it would be. But yeah, I thought I should try it. So if only the printer will work here again, yes. And as you can see here, I have already printed it on the wrong side one time. But here we have it on the right side. Yeah, like this. So the quality is not uh, too perfect, but it works. As you can see here, I have cut some of it out, but yeah, I'm gonna show you. So then you just take this off and it's a decal. And then, so as you can see here, this would be impossible to get out. And also you can see what it says, but the danger here that will work. And all this volatile chemicals and stuff will work perfect on the trailer, I think. But for, for now, let's get back to the truck. So that's what I have here in the front. And also on the door side he, here are the trucking is uh, decals like that. It's not totally perfect, but it will work. But then the rest of the text under that and back on the sleeper, that was my girlfriend who write that with a white uh, pen. Turned out really good. I know Albuquerque is supposed to be yellow on the real one, but yeah, I think I'm gonna go with white because it's close enough. And also because I tried to paint it yellow and the white color just come off. So yeah, I think that would be like that for now. Then I 3D printed some MAC emblems and painted them with the chrome color, the Revel. So yeah, that turned out like this. That would work fine, I think. I've, in my world, that's perfect. In other people's worlds, probably not perfect, but from here, I think it looks fantastic. So yeah, that's how the truck looks right now. So let's check out the trailer here, maybe. I just have made a frame to try it, and, but I think it works pretty good. The tank is lying on top, pretty neat, so yeah, I think that's gonna work. Will be some cables here for all the electronics to it later, will look like air hoses. And yeah, then I got the axles for the trailer wheels. So I fixed everything here, as you can see. So it's actually standing on its own tires. So hopefully soon I can test drive it. I just need to get all this electric cable up so the drive shaft doesn't break it when I drive. So that can be pretty interesting because it's really long. I'm not totally sure how long it is. But the truck is 75 centimeters and the trailer is at least 120. And here you can see I have a letter. It's on the wrong side for the original one but that's easy to change later on here i have also made my own pipe here for the hose because the original was a bit too big i'm gonna show you the new one here hold on here we have it my own design on it so here we have a lid so i can put a hose in there if i want to i'm not sure if i will have that or not on this one we will see my plan is to get a tank in the tank, but yeah, we will see about that. But yeah, this will sit here. I think that would be pretty good. Maybe it's a bit too long, but yeah, we will see. Then we'll get some lights there and back there. And also I will cut this out 
and put some positions light over there. So yeah, that was what I had to show you on the rubber duck truck so far. I know it's not much, but yeah, still going slow, but I'm getting there, getting there. So yeah, thank you so much for watching and hopefully I see you in one or two weeks and maybe we can see it rolling. Let's hold our thumbs. So see you, goodbye.